wasn't my fault. The kid walked away for 10 minutes. I mean, it could happen to anybody. It's not my decision, Janet. When an incident like this happens, we always remove the child till the agency can review the situation. The kid found a pinky. It's no big deal. It might be an indication that you and Raymond are overtaxed here. I mean, you already have four foster children. Yeah, well, we're doing the very best we can, Mrs. Green. I know you are, Janet. Why don't you call my office in the morning, and we'll see where we stand, OK? Say goodbye. Here we go. Can I help you? Hi, I'm Natalie Teeger, and this is Adrian Monk, and we're working with the police on the investigation. About the severed? Yep. Yeah, right. Mrs. Crane, Teresa Crane. I'm Tommy's caseworker. A Monk. I see you two have met before. What happens to him now? It's a tough one. I've been trying to place him with the family in Livingston. It would be a perfect match, but they can't take him for two weeks. I'll take him. What? What are you going to do, adopt him? I'll take him. I'll take him. What? Uh, this is the last form. Just sign here. doesn't have to be perfect. Maybe it does. Normally, I would prefer a longer waiting period, but because you and Tommy have already bonded and it's just a temporary placement, I decided to go with my instincts. There we go. Congratulations. Thank now. You. Before I go, do you have any questions for me? Yes, yes, I have a couple of questions. What does he eat? He eats food. <laughs> he eats whatever you eat, only smaller portions. So he's like a person. Exactly. And when he wakes up? Yes. What do I do? You, you take care of him. You play with him. You love him. How, how, how do I love him? Mr. Monk, you don't need me to tell you that. You're off to a great start with Tommy. <laughs> he likes you already, a lot. You can always call your friend Natalie. I think she's great. Oh, I'll check in tomorrow and see how you're doing. Wait. Oh, sec, wait a minute. Wait, you, you're leaving? You're leaving now. Wait, right now. Wait. You'll be fine. Just trust yourself. Bye, Tommy. Have fun. Well, thank you. Thanks, thanks again. No, no, Tommy, don't cry. I promise I'm going to do the best I can. It's okay. Don't cry. Don't cry. Everything's okay. What is the oh, nature no. of your emergency? It's everywhere. BM, it's BM. BM. BM, it's BM. Sir, you have to stop oh, saying BM, BM now. Do you mean your child is soiling his diaper? Yes. Yes, he's soiling his, his diaper with, with, you know, BM. You mean you've never changed a diaper? Hurry! OK, listen carefully. There should be two Velcro straps on the sides. Find the two straps. OK. OK, I've got the straps. Now rip them open. 
Okay, sir. All right. Do you have any wipes? Yes, I've got about two thousand. That should be fine. It's not gonna be enough. Sir, you're gonna have to wipe your son's bottom. <laughs> sir, is the boy all right? He's fine. That was me. Wait a minute. Oh my God, he's making more. Is it number uh, one or number two? It's one. And two, and, and, oh my God, it's, it's three. It's number three. Sir, I'm afraid you're on your own. This line is for emergencies only. That's right, children. That was the piano. And that instrument was the violin. Now let's listen to the piano and the violin. It's jungle out there. Disorder and confusion everywhere. No one seems to care. Well, I do. Hey! Who's in charge here? It's John.